I'm Anthony Jesus, and joining me on the trading floor of the New York Stock Exchange is CFO of Siemens, Joe Kayser. Joe, you're here at the New York Stock Exchange, a listed company for over 10 years. What does this mean to you and your company? Well, that's great, especially on a day where our stock is up 7%. It's uh, not, you don't happen to see that that often, so it's a good day today. You just also recently announced a share buyback program. Can you tell me a little bit about that program? Well, actually, we announced it last night after the close of the stock exchange here in New York, and uh, it is not a, the usual stuff, uh, what uh, people would expect from a share buyback, where you use some liquidity and then uh, get it off to shareholders by buying back shares. What we actually have been doing was what I would call a, an equity debt swap. So we take about 4 billion US dollars, which is about 3 billion U, uh, uh, euro, uh, finance that on the bond market uh, in 10 to 30 years uh, maturity, take that money and buy back shares. So what that does, it uh, secures us a great lock-in of very cheap historical uh, interest rates on the back of saving a lot of dividend yield, which is up to 4.5%. So Siemens is a major employee in the U.S. with over 60,000 people in areas such as the healthcare industry and energy. Could you maybe elaborate on the huge shale gas findings and what you think that the future U.S. economy and impact of your business will uphold? Well, I, I believe that this whole natural gas uh, development in the United States is a, is a generation-wide opportunity for the United States and its people to regain, uh, you know, global competitive industrial strengths. This is more something which only happens once in a lifetime to change the course of deindustrialization. Uh, so that's great and there's all the opportunities. You hold all the cards in your hand to become a net exporter of energy as you know today which uh, has a lot of import. Joe Kayser, CFO of Siemens, thank you for taking the time and joining us here at the New York Stock Exchange. Thank you very much.